guys it's ziggy i'm back here today and i would just like to show you guys some of you guys had requested for me to show you guys how i do um how i add in overlays onto my videos now um basically what you need is a video editor that has more than one track a track is basically one of these more more than one uh, video track so i'm gonna go ahead and just turn these off just what i normally do for my videos um but uh for unfortunately some most free softwares for editing softwares you they don't come with um more than one track of each thing um windows movie maker believe it or not i do use it when i need just a quick, a quick video um most of the time i'll use uh uh, uh windows movie maker i keep forgetting the name um, for the UHCs because the solo UHCs because it's just that's really all I need it for I don't need it for very much, but uh, yeah, so Let me explain so you need a picture-in-picture -picture, uh, video editor which allows you to put a picture on top of a video and That allows you to you know have a video there now You need the picture in order to have a picture there you need to have a transparent background or if you just need just a picture displaying something then i'll show you how to do it with sony vegas but i don't know how to do it really with any other video editing software this is the only editing software i've ever had so i mean i had mac which basically you just drag and drop and this is the same thing you can do so i'm gonna go ahead and grab an image over here and this is a picture of a churro don't ask why i have a churro i wanted a churro the other day and i couldn't get it so obviously this is not a transparent background so I'm just gonna go ahead and let me just see if uh, I can change this real fast. Okay, maybe I can't. Okay, well, anyways, if I wanted to show throughout this whole video, then I could. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and mute both of these clips because they're not uh, needed. So let's just say if I wanted to edit this down, then I could. I just need to let it load. Um, okay, so here is where I have the video effects. You can go ahead and shrink it as much as you want. I'm gonna go ahead and move that back to my other monitor. So if I sh if I move this around, if you move the border around, you can. Um, you can have the different uh, f like versions of it, I guess. Uh, but let me go ahead and use hopefully a clear background. I'm hoping this will work. Uh, maybe it won't. Yep, there it is. So if I wanted just to have the whole MCSG kind of thing in the background, then I could. Um, let me go ahead and show you guys. I do. This is just a random raw footage that I have. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and open my montage here. I'm gonna show you guys in the beginning. You guys don't need to hear the music, obviously. Um, because it's not that important, but I'm gonna go ahead and mute this clip and I'm gonna go ahead and mute this one and mute this one. All right, so here is where I have um, this uh, this clip. You guys get to see a little preview of it. I'm not gonna play the song either, but here's the beginning clip. So if I wanted to see it slow, you can make it fade in or whatever. So it has to be um, above whatever image you have here. So um, yeah, it's kind of hard to explain. Um, that's really all I know and what I've learned. You can't do it with Windows Movie Maker. That's really all I know. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this clip before I go ahead and show you the rest. But <laughs> yeah, so let me go ahead and sh just prove to you that you cannot do it in um, Windows Movie Maker. I'm gonna go ahead and just grab some raw footage I have somewhere within here. Uh, videos, I'm gonna go ahead and find some. I gotta find one that's not like, hopefully a big file. Um, I think I'm gonna come back to you guys once uh, this is done loading. All right, so now this is done loading, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that you cannot put it on top. Uh, it's unfortunately only one track, um, one for only audio and one for only um, one for only music. And you can add music, but the music sounds very bad, so I suggest not using this unless you're gonna, you know, you need a quick video that's you don't really care about the audio quality or that much, or you don't really care that it's kind of loud. The music but you can fortunately can't add in like anything else you can only put it to the sides it, this one kind of sucks but you know whatever that's my logo by the way just if you guys didn't know so uh yeah so basically that's just about it anyways guys i hope this did help you in a little bit um you can get some of this stuff for free also i use action to record and sony vegas to edit for my thumbnails i make photo i use photoshop and cinema 4d so in case any of you guys need that information go ahead um but you guys can search up how to get that stuff for free because uh, this is not a video for that. So yeah, I'll see you guys on the next video.